today we're doing the first ever A through Z alphabet no budget fishing challenge on YouTube. <laughs> to the Fishing Nor YouTube channel. Comment is popping up down below. Let's go ahead and subscribe button, hit the bell, leave a comment down below for your future chance to be in the next video's comment of the day. Today, we're doing the first ever A through Z alphabet no budget fishing challenge on YouTube. You guys might be saying, Norm, what is the A through Z challenge? It's exactly how it sounds. We're starting with the letter A, buying fishing supplies, going all the way to the letter Z, and we have to catch a fish on every single letter of the alphabet. You might be saying, Norm, that's like 26 letters. How are you gonna do that? Well, I got some help right here behind me. So one thing me, Mason, and Fletcher all have in common, I think all you guys, is we just buy way more fishing gear than we even know what to do with. It's just what fishermen do. So guys, we've done a ton of shopping challenges before, but this one's gonna be crazy because we have to go through the whole entire alphabet. So here's how it's gonna work. We're gonna split the alphabet up into three sections. Two people get nine letters, one person gets eight letters. You have to buy rod, reel, line, lures, and everything with the letters you are assigned. And to win this challenge, you have to catch a fish on every single thing you buy with the alphabet. So if you get some bad letters, good luck. For an instance here, if we get B, we buy a boat. That sounds like a great deal. Oh dang, I really should have thought this was <laughs> oh, a good idea. Yes. So on the wheel, we have A through I, J through R, and S through Z. If you land on S through Z, you have to go to Walmart, which is right across the street because you have less letters. <laughs> and the two other teams need to go into Dick's Sporting Goods with a crazy selection. So, so you guys want to guess, Mason, you want to go first? I guess. Oh, what's uh -oh. happening? What's happening? Dude, it, oh, oh, you got it! Oh, yes. no! There's a B in that. Looks like Dude, somebody's getting a brand like... new boat. <laughs> Butcher, I'll let you go next. You either get the eight letters and go to Walmart, or you get J through R. I already so. know I'm going to Walmart. I don't even have to look at this. I'm gonna be so bummed out. I always lose my own challenges. Oh. <laughs> No! Oh, it's not J through R. <laughs> no. So Mason has A through I, Fletcher has J through R, which leaves me with S through Z and being exiled to Walmart. So now that all of us have our letters assigned to us, we have to go inside by rod, reel, line, and lures, and that's all you're allowed to buy with your letters. Three, two, one, go. All right, guys, I'm up first. A through I, rod, reel, line, lures, and then other stuff incorporated into that. The pressure's on. I fold under pressure super easily, so let's start off with a rod. I gotta get the juices flowing, so American Hero. Oh, hey, come on. <laughs> that took a second. Abu Garcia. He said it in the intro. He said A for Abu. <laughs> Too easy, dude. All right, guys, we made it into Walmart. I have the letters S all the way to the letter Z, which I'm a little worried about, but I only have eight letters. The other boys have nine. We have to buy five fishing lures each to complete the challenge, at least five, but it could be more than that. So I'm gonna start with S and see if there's any nice combos in here that start with a decent letter. I really want a bait cast. I know those guys got like Shimano and Luz and like all these good companies and Dick Sporting Goods. I think the only bait casters they have is right here. This one is $98, it's the Lose, wait, XS Fish. The Lose Xfinity. X was the number one letter I was worried about. We'll come back to it, but that is such good news. I could go for S, my first letter, with a Shakespeare, but the Xfinity is gonna save me. Thank goodness I have a decent combo. Whew. We have made it to the fishing section, guys, and I think there's only one thing that makes sense to do. <sighs> You. Someone will be with you shortly. Hey. How's it going, man? We are trying to find lures and lures. tackle starting with the letter J. So I need you to help oh, me yeah. find something that starts with a J, and we're going to go from J to R. And we're, the goal is to try to find something on every letter. Okay, that should be pretty easy. You got any ideas for J? Yeah, I think we got some jawbone lures and everything. Jawbone? Okay. Jawbone. Let's see. Let's see what you got. Oh, yeah. This is exactly the kind of stuff I'm looking for. I'm thinking this red crawl jawbone, they're kind of moving up shallow and stuff right now. Yeah. Fish really like the red in the spawn time. So that is J. I think we kind of need a rod and a reel though. Do you have any ideas for K? A, B. I don't think that's the brand, but they put that in big bold letters. 
That's the brand. Braided is the brand. That's what I'm going with. I feel like 20 pound braided line is really thick. I feel like that's absurdly thick, but I also don't, I don't fish them in sometimes. So let's see. So the goal is to try to catch a fish on everything. If I have one bad lure, it could completely mess up my game. So I'm thinking for S, I'm going to go with a Strike King, but to make it interesting, I don't know if they eat buzz baits out there, but it could be kind of cool. I'm going to do it. A little bit of top water action, make it a little bit crazy. Don't want to take this one by storm because I do have one less letter. So this is basically a free pick. Kids casters. Yeah. yeah I kind of like the, the Minecraft one for all our gamer fans. Yeah, you can never go wrong with Minecraft. Minecraft, do you ever do you ever catch fish in Minecraft? I have played Minecraft for quite a few hours in my lifetime. Yeah, <laughs> well, we got the next letter. So we got J, K, L. We're gonna need, let's see, lizards, okay. Lizard. We got everything here. We got some six inch, four inch mini lizards as well. Come what on. do you think the big female bass would prefer, the four inch or the six inch lizards? I'm gonna have to assume females are most likely gonna like the six inch lizard. See, knocked out, crushed. So this is like a sweet little swim bait. That's the color of fish that I have seen before in my lifetime in Florida. We're not in Florida. It'll work for Florida type fish though, bass. B for bass. So T, I don't know what starts with T, but we'll see if we find anything. It could be the brand, it could be the type of lure, or it could even be a color if it, we have to make it like that. The problem with my section two is I literally just have this, and if I can't find a letter, I don't even know what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna have to buy something completely random. Why is T so hard? I feel like I'm missing like something very obvious. T as in a little bit trick boy. Oh, dude, you're so close <laughs> for that. Guys, I was stumped on T for the longest. Forgot one of my favorite lures of all time is a trick worm. <laughs> dude, good call, man. Trick worm, we have, they only have one color. It's just a straight up black. So I guess this is what we're, oh, they have trick worm green, pumpkin green. That's what we got to go with right there. Natural color, 20 pack too. One of my favorite lures of all time. Can rig it up so many different ways. T for trick worm, QSTU is next. Y'all have a refrigerator in here? Finger bowl would be right down here in this drawer. Perfect. All right. Well, let's go with the finger bowl. I think that's definitely the move for M. L M N. Why is it so hard to figure out like what comes next exactly. in the alphabet? Yep, yep. When you like take a letter in the middle of the alphabet, it's hard to figure out what comes next. It's like trying to do the alphabet backwards. Okay. <laughs> uh, we could do Ned Riggs. Ned Riggs. Oh, yeah. okay. let's definitely do that. The deadly Nedley. I think we're just go go for the full kit. The more money we spend of norms, the better. We got A, we got B, we got C. The next letter is D. Let's go find a D. I actually kind of have a D in mind. I saw this crazy cat earlier. I just don't know about it. It's got to catch a fish. The dark sleeper. It is like a, it's a funky, multicolored frog looking fish thing. It's like a baby tadpole fish. D, dark sleeper, funky looking little thing going on there. It'll work, it'll do the trick, we'll catch the fish. We're gonna win this challenge. You can alphabet on me. So now we're on the letter U. I realized I think I got the most difficult part of the alphabet. U, I was thinking off the rip, umbrella rig, but they don't have any in Walmart. If I was in Dick Sporting Goods, I definitely would get one. Then I was thinking underspin. So the only thing they have is a butt tail, but it does have an underspin on it. There's nothing else in the store that starts with you. And even though it doesn't say it on the packaging, underspin is a U. So I think that will make this count. And it's actually could catch a giant. So U is on QRSTUV. Boom, right here. Check this out. Vanish line. And we're gonna go with whatever the highest they have is because we have a buzz bait already. 14 pound Berkeley vanish line. We're flying through this. QRSTUVW. Worm. Come on, come on, dude. All the hard letters are easy. Luckily we did get W, which might be like the easiest scoop. We're gonna go with just a worm, so I can go with my favorite worm because it's such a broad topic. I think we're gonna go ahead and get, gosh, I don't even have my favorite worms here. What we're gonna get for 498 is the culprit worms, but we have a double W because we have worms and this color is watermelon red. Poor. So super funky and weird color to try. But W was probably the easiest letter of this whole entire challenge. But now we have W X. I think we need some hooks, especially for, for, the our, for the mullet. Oh, uh, we got some octopus hooks that we can do. Some Gamagatsu octopus hooks. That's always my go-to brand, personally. 
We got regular octopus hooks or we got octopus circle hooks. Which size do you think we should go for with this mullet? I would say size four oct in line circle hook. All right, well, hopefully we can get a vaccine mullet. You're not making this easy for me, man. I'm not gonna lie. I like the net rig, I like the jawbone, I like the lizard, but you're really gonna push me out of my comfort zone with the with the mullet here. <laughs> L-M-N-O-P, A, B, C, D, E, E. Eagle claw hook. Get lower. Get lower. Get, get, get down. Okay, sweet. There they are. Eagle claw hooks. I can't see the big, that kind of hook. Texas rig hook is the name of it that I'm thinking of. I don't see those. Gosh, these are really small hooks. It'll work. The nicest rod and reel in the whole entire store starts with X. We have the Xfinity combo, $98. And I'll be fishing with a bait caster that is a medium heavy, fast action, six foot 10, which will be great for everything I'm using besides maybe the buzz bait. And we have the line with the V. So now QRS TV WX Y. Dude, why? Another easy one. Why? We have one of the most popular fishing brands of all time, which is Yum. And they're completely picked off the wall here. So I can go anything Yum. We'll do something crazy. Go with these massive craw bogs. Check these things out. Look at those little dudes. The old yum crawl Y is off the list, which leaves us with Z. And I thought Z was gonna be extremely hard, but you have the next most popular brand, Zoom. So anything from Zoom. I think I like managed to get some pretty good stuff. Oh, some of the mock baits patrollers are stuff right now. That is, I don't think you can go wrong with the mock patroller. El Mino P Q. That's a tough one. Some quakes. I was I was thinking that was gonna take me a second to actually figure out Ooh. something that started with a Q. You were right off the rip, man. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna go with the red again. They really like the crawl color this time of year. Let's go ahead and yeah. toss that in, and I think we only have one more to go. Yeah, it's our ours. ours next. Yeah. That's our last thing. Football jig. A B C D E F. F. We're gonna go with the football jig with that green sparkly color because that's the only one I know to work. A. B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. I need to get, okay, I got line. Yami Moto. Right, right here, here we go. The rattling pears. Well, I think that's everything we need. We have enough stuff to catch five fish, right? Cause that's what Norm told me. So we got mullet, we got the jawbone, we got the Ned rig, we got the lizards, and we got the patroller. And we got and the, the quake, quake yeah. so that's five. I think, yeah, I think. All right, well, I appreciate it, man. Yes, sir. Honestly, no helping me out. Horny toads. The minimal fishing I have done back in middle school, horny toads. Run them suckers top water, get the little flappers flipping. I. I, I want an inline spinner. Truth be told, we looked everywhere for something that starts with I, couldn't find it. So we're gonna get a technicality here and run with the inline spinner. Inline spinner. Yep, that works, okay. Inline spinner. To make it crazy, and this will be the last lure I was fishing with, we're gonna go with the pink zoom bubblegum super fluke. <laughs> <laughs> and we've completed the challenge. So overall, we have rod and reel combo. Honestly, my favorite line to use whenever I'm in Walmart, the Vanish, to combine with it. So most expensive, best line I like to use. And we have four packs of soft plastics, which I think will be super easy. A buzz bait, which will be a lot of fun. And last but not least, a hair jig underspin. Overall, for Walmart, eight letters, I think I might have got the best selection. So to keep your business thriving, you need to find ways to save money without cutting corners. ShipStation's dashboard makes it super easy to manage orders. And if you're on the fence about it, now's the time to try it out. Oh, it's about to go. And me and Mason's favorite part about ShipStation is probably, honestly, the money we save on shipping costs. So that means we save money. That means people buying our product also save money because we don't have to charge as much for shipping. And Mason is currently working on Facebook Marketplace, flipping and reselling water vessels, automobiles, pretty much anything he get his hands on. I'm working on selling merchandise, but what's really cool about ShipStation is we can combine the two together and both of us can work from one place. It's dope. <laughs> it is pretty dope. <laughs>
And ShipStation hooks you up with industry-leading discounts so you never have to worry about overpaying for shipping again. Over 130,000 companies have grown their e-commerce business with ShipStation. And 98% of companies that stick with ShipStation for a year are customers for life. ShipStation effortlessly integrates everywhere you can sell online, including Amazon, Etsy, eBay, and more. Worry less about the bottom line when you save money with ShipStation. Go to ShipStation.com slash norm today and sign up for a free 60-day trial. That's ShipStation.com slash norm. So thank you so much to ShipStation for sponsoring today's video. Now back with the regular content. All right guys, we have made it to the pond. We have uh, Mason in the back and we replaced Fletcher with Trey because it's Easter right now and he has a family. <laughs> and I am fishing with Norm. <laughs> so we lost a couple of the things on the way back to Florida, but for the most part, we have all the same stuff. Trey Soul has figured out that he's fishing with a Minecraft rod and a ton of the lures in there. The only thing I switched up was I couldn't find the same hair air jig at my Walmart, so I switched up like with a different underspin for you. And then Mason has everything that he got because he's responsible. But we have until dark to see who can complete the A through Z challenge first. You have to catch a fish on every single lure starting uh, right now. So boys, the pond we're fishing is absolutely covered in lily pads. That's right, you have six pound fluorocarbon. Mason, you have- 20 pound braid. C for crankbait <laughs> is what oh, you're- Oh, <laughs> I see what you're saying. Yeah. C? C. See, yes, okay. <laughs> All right, I feel like I definitely have the best odds. I'm scared to open this bag. <laughs> yeah, you see what's in there. Oh, you. okay, we're not ruined. We got some lizards. I think I'm gonna start with those. Lizards would be, I'm assuming L. I mean, you guys know everything when we picked all the letters. I'm gonna see what I'm gonna start with. Really, dude, one of the only scaries in my bag is this buzz bait. I'm gonna save it for later in the day as the sun goes down. And I have pink flukes. But I'm gonna start with, those crawls are kind of crazy. I'm gonna save those. We might start with just something super easy and work our way to harder lures. I'm gonna start with the old trick worms and watermelon red. This crankbait is not gonna work. I am just eating every weed in this thing. It dives really deep. Mason, I, if we would have gone where I thought we were going, you would have been good. Yeah. Boys, I think my lizard's gonna catch him. <laughs> my only concern is this kitty rod. But have no fears, cause I just, oh bro, that's good. That I was chilling, I'm good. I'm catching them. I'm so happy I have, I got the last part of the alphabet tray with all the hard le letters. I was so concerned. And then I realized Zoom starts with Z uh, and dude. W has worm. Dude, my combo, the only baitcaster in Walmart, Xfinity, it started with X. <laughs> was it? Yeah. Oh, so I kind of, I kind of got really lucky. I thought I was going to be the worst. Yeah, I definitely got the worst of this one. You got sure. the short end of the stick. Yeah, I definitely got the short rod, you know? The short rod of the, the rod of locker. The family of the challenge. Well, Mason, good news is I don't think anybody's ever thrown a crankbait in here. So uh, you might be the first yeah. one to ever show uh, this presentation. A, the deepest diving crankbait <laughs> Dick Sporting Goods could sell. You could have used C for craw. You could have seen oh. UC for like a, there's oh. like California go Gold Rush. It's like a really popular color. No, 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 no. No way, Trey. Let's go. No. 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 No way, Trey. Oh, you took the L for lizard, bro. Gosh, dude, no. I have A through I. A, because I'm an absolute beast. B for best fisherman. C for craziest You sure cool you don't kid. have W for worst driver? A. Town USA. How's Pensacola, Trey? Oh, really? Got one. Oh, no yes. way. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, the trend, mate. Yes, sir. Here, I got you with the net basin and for net. And for no, I don't even need that. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's go. Goodness, oh, goodness. I can't believe you're first to strike, dude, with a crankbait out here. That's pretty impressive. I was just reeling it really slow so it would stay out of the weeds. All right, buddy, let's get you back in. That's a beautiful fish. Thanks, bud. You put me in the lead. S for swim away. Bye bye. All right, so we got the dark sleeper, which is kind of a pretty cool looking little little guy. It's got a weight in it. Kind of a weedless hook. I don't know if that is that even considered weedless. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. It has like a like a almost like a built-in weed guard with the fin. Yeah. So that might might come in C for clutch. Oh, I got one. I got one. Get him. He's a. He, oh my gosh, he was a baby, baby, dude. <laughs> Be for little baby. <laughs> How's those fishing combos? Nice. 
they're pretty fun to use i'm not gonna lie dang dude i haven't really done anything with mine yet but it's it's pretty cool yeah mine works really really good Just at least like nice to hold it like, yeah <gasps> oh no <laughs> dude i love kitty rods so much i was like a four pounder Get yes Trey. dude and it jammed <laughs> J for jam. J for jam. <laughs> Pe peanut butter and jam. All right, who's placing best my first cast on this? I catch a fish. I think you got to set the hook pretty hard on that, right, Trey? This? No, the dark sleeper? Uh, a little bit, not really. Got one. Get him, Norm. Got one. Get him, Norm. Got one. Get him, Norm. Oh my gosh, he's all the way in the pad. No, he came off. Dude, I should have got braid. Dang it. Dang, I had him for sure, though, for a good amount of time. Dang it, dude. <laughs> Don't mind me getting my second lizard because I've done <laughs> missed two fish now. <laughs> Elf oh, this one you kind of work like a jig, right? Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you could, yeah, you could also swim it like a, a crankbait. With how clear this water is, they'll be able to see it real good. Yeah, just swim that thing. Let us cast in this hole up here. Which hole? Go a little bit further. You're talking about the open pocket? Yeah. Yeah, I got you. Reverse! Reverse! Oh, Trent, I got the net. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come goodness. On. Yeah. yeah. That's a fish. Dude, on the kitty rod, let's go. Four fish later, I finally caught one. And it's tiny. Dang it. Thanks, Beefer Bass. See ya. <laughs> Dang, Trey, now you're going to have to find something else in the bag. I feel like you didn't even get a lot of good stuff. I didn't, dude. I got the worst <laughs> stuff possible. How are you, uh, how are you reeling your zoom, Trey? I don't know, it's a secret. I don't know if I... Oh yeah, I do have one. I do have Get one. Him. You got one on the water. Get oh, dude. Him. Bring him in. Oh, Bring it's not even a bad one. It's a good one. Holy you got him, Norm. You got him. Come here, baby. Yeah. Let's go, dude. Easiest lure off. The list, dude, he freaking swallowed it. I'll have to get him out with some pliers. All right, guys, first fish. There she goes. Dude. Oh, dude. Yeah, Trey. Yes. We both knocked them. We're all tied one to one to one now. The oh. only thing is, I think one of us has more lures than the rest. Because <laughs> I only had eight letters. You guys had nine. Guys, these are kind of like a really cool color. Uh, green and red. Super natural color. And the curly tail worm in here slays. Probably my favorite lure to throw in the spawn. You, you snap off? off the dark sleeper. Uh oh. You your what's your what's your E? I have one less lure to fish with. <laughs> a B C D E F, right? Football jig. Yeah. So I got okay. So F because the E is the uh, T for two catches on the football jig because you snapped yours off. I found G for rounds. girl. <laughs> <laughs> I got possibly the worst lure ever created, the Ned Rig. Dude, stop that. Do you actually mean that? Do you not like it? It's a bite getter. Yeah, it's a, dude. It's a bite I love getter. the Ned Rig. I'm actually kind of jealous about that. Dude, you, we can Not trade. Not the combo, but. <laughs> we can trade. I'm just gonna swim. Watch, I'm gonna catch one in like three cast. I feel like that's your easiest one, even over the lizard, dude. I feel like it is, if I can keep it out of the lily pads. <gasps> oh no! I just missed another one. Gosh, dude, I hate Minecraft rods. Let's go, 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 let's go. <laughs> yes! There's got to be the size limit on this challenge. Ah, no! <laughs> oh my god, oh it's not a bad one, let's go! Dude, that's actually a chunk, bro, that's like a three pounder. Dude, holy smokes, yeah! Dude, I got a bass. Dude, well, I can eat you. <laughs> Mine's like the size of a swim bait. <laughs> He's literally swim bait size. All well, right. That's when you know you're catching biggins. <laughs> it's literally a men of <laughs> Fish bump, dude. Fish bump, <laughs> get him back. All right. Sweet. Dude, that might have been close to three. I think it was like two and a half pounds. That was a good one. Well, there goes my two easy lures. It only gets harder from here, ladies and gentlemen. So let's see what else we have. I got these uh, ridiculous yum craws, the craw bugs. That looks tasty, dude. <laughs> and oh. oh, my bad. I have pink flukes and underspin the buzz bait. I think I'm going to go craws next. 
these peak flukes are a little bit crazier, especially with this clear water. A little frog diddler on here. I think these actually kind of look cool. It's just like a weird lure to throw. I don't know why. Yell it? No. Ah. Mr. Craw is rigged and ready. <laughs> oh, this is a weird one. But do you have a crawfish crankbait? <laughs> oh, is that what you're up with? Though? That's what I'm up with. Uh oh. It's going to get interesting. Dude, I'm just hoping I get a reaction strike by dropping this thing down on some pads. And they're like, what the heck is that? I really don't like the look of this bait at all. Dude, I feel like I got something out of my grandpa's tackle box. That looks, I feel like that should work. I think it will. It's just like everything else is worse than this. I am also the least knowledgeable person here to say that so trey's crawfish crankbait was supposed to be the other crawfish crankbait but dick sporting goods is closed because it's easter Dude, so it don't look that bad i'm gonna get a bite on that i just gotta find a hole i can hit not lily pads like that it's all right though i think i think we're gonna be okay i think i'm gonna float over it and i might get a sick top water eat while i'm waiting i feel like if you were fishing with this jig you'd have had a fish fly <gasps> oh, oh no way oh, 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 oh yes he lost it oh, Dang it! Dude, Trey's just getting torn up on these random bluebirds. <laughs> when are we? <laughs> when are we getting bit every cast? Trey, just like a. Oh, wait. Oh! This is a jig! Let's go! Yes. <laughs> and he's off, just like that. That was over the boat. <laughs> he didn't touch him. It counts. So we'll count it as one of your two. You still have to catch another one on it. <laughs> I was literally about to ask Trey what, uh, how he would fish this if he was fishing. Dude, with I'm it. not helping my ops, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Respect. Hold on, let me catch this fish right quick. Oh, I caught that! I caught it! I caught it, Nor! I caught it! I caught it! Oh, please! please. Yeah! Yes! Yes! Dude, did you hear that? I said, let me catch this fish right quick. He bit it! Let's go! No way, bro. Feel how warm he is. Oh, shoot. oh! Let's go, dude. dude that on the so crazy. Ah, on the crawfish crankbait. Let's go. I said, let's catch this fish, and he bit, dude. Let's <laughs> freaking go. Dude, that is ridiculous. That's... You're only two lures away, dude. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting close, dude. Broad. Bro, Mason, this is just embarrassing, it dude. It really is. <laughs> I am getting close. Thank you so much for biting, buddy, and not making me look like a goober on YouTube. <laughs> Dude, I'm having a blast with this kitty rod. I ain't gonna lie. Thanks for biting, buddy. See ya. Oh, I just need something to bite. I'm still on my third lure tray. It's two fish catches on the plopper away from winning, and he's using a kitty pole. Pink fluke, dude. I'm gonna catch up, man. I feel like this one's gonna be easy. I don't wanna say that out loud, but I feel like I can get one on this in five minutes. Go. <laughs> Oh, I got one, I got one. Yes, 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 Mason, yes, Mason. Keep that line tight. Let's go. Where is he? Oh, 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 oh. I got you, man. I got you. I got you. Come here, Fuji. I got you. <laughs> right into the net. That was a slam dunk cat. Heck Burr. yeah, dude. You did good. a good job setting the hook, too. Like, reeling down to him and then jacking it up. I'll fix that later. <laughs> Come good here. stuff, man. Yes. Yes, these have all kind of ah. <laughs> these have all kind of been like the same size fish. Yeah, dude, there's some giants in here, but there's a lot of like you know one to Solid. two pounders and a couple yeah. threes and fours. That other one you had though was like a three or four pounder. Yeah, that was a big one. The, that and the that first one that I lost too. So that means you're gonna move on to your next lure now. Finally, you got Heck two yeah. on the jig. Oh, he's a he's a spunky little fellow. All right, we'll see you later. Look at him flapping, flap, flap, flap. <laughs> Nice, dude. Heck yeah. What do you have left? I have Horny Toad. That knocks out Jig and Cinco. Right. Let's get these guys going. <gasps> oh, he busted me out of the water, dude. Got him that time. 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 Dude, like literally second cast on the big fluke. This is not the craw, dude. That was crazy. He came up for it, hit my fluke out the water, came back for it, and now we got the fluke off the list. Let's go. Just a little one pounder, but thank you, buddy. 
You know, I wish that wouldn't have happened that quick because now I have to tie it off. And that's a bummer. <laughs> All right, so I got Cross. Yeah, dude, that fluke, I popped it twice and went like darted and then he just yeah let me get that yeah no nah, that's a fun bite gosh i wish i could do that all day but we got to tie on the terrible craw again Dude, i'm gonna try them weightless this time and just work them really erotic like erratic and just hope something happens dumb enough to eat it yeah I really just wish I had a real fishing rod, dude. Well, you can, dude. You'll catch one right behind me. <laughs> I'm using a crawfish. That's not even real. They're all oh, my gosh. Get him. No one. Yeah, yeah. We fail. We fail. Finally, the crawfish after an hour. I need you. No. No. Space it. Do something. <laughs> gosh, it's such a terrible fishing lure. That's good, though. Like, it's good that at least, at least you had a fish. You know it's possible for a fish to eat it. That's it. I don't want to play this game anymore. I quit, I quit, I quit. I miss Cinco's. Cinco. I can get a bite on this plopper for nothing, dude. I'll let you have that lane, Trey. What lane? I can't see right. it. This? Yeah. I'm going to lose it in them pads. Uh oh, it's gonna it's gonna close the game. Get in the boat. Oh, yes. That's oh that was a good hook set, Mason. Thank you. Oh, oh. Look at that. Look at that hook set. Oh goodness. Oh yeah, that was a good hook set. Right in the schnauzer. Atta boy. That's another one out of the way. Let's see, I got horny toad and the spinner bait. <gasps> oh, All right, he missed see, the crawl. He <gasps> got him. Oh, There's God. no way he's coming off. Please. No! Oh, he jumped out of the water. Oh my gosh, dude. I just hit my ear so hard with my hand. Ow. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. This craw is driving me insane. I gotta hand it to you. It's driving me crazy. <laughs> well, guys, I have three lures left the craw, the inline spinner, and the buzz bait. Trey has to catch two on the whopper plopper, and Mason has to catch one on the horny toad, one on his inline spinner. It's a pretty close game right now. There's a lot of top water and tough lures left, however, so it's going to be kind of difficult. Dang it. How do you probably hear it? Oh no! I got him! 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 Come here! Please come here! Please come here! Please! Please! Let's go! Let's go! Trey's one fish away from winning now. Oh, that gives me so much more confidence. You don't even hear him blow up. He just sucked it under. Heck yeah. Well, Norm is tying Mason's bait on right now, and I just call one fish closer to the wind bass. <gasps> he... oh, can I catch a fish on a crawfish, please? He missed it twice, dude. It's driving me crazy. I can't do this for much longer. It's gonna make me go insane. Come back for it, please. Got him, got him, got him. Oh, oh, he's coming. Yes, craw, craw, craw. Yeah. Thank you for coming back a fifth time. Let's go. Dude, I thought it was never going to be over. I thought it was going to last forever. Whew. All right. Now it's two to two to one. Yep. Oh, boy. Dude, I think that might be the worst lure ever. It's terrible, guys. If you use this, please tell me why. It looks cool, like out of the water, then you put it in and it's terrible, but we got him. Thank you, buddy. Thank goodness. Inline spinner and a buzz bait with 14 pound fluorocarbon. That's gonna uh -oh. be fun. <laughs> All right, inline spinner, or underspin, my bad, not inline spinner. All right. So guys, the only one I had to replace that didn't have in my Walmart was that weird underspin I got, but I found these, which look even crazier than the one I had before. You for underspin? S for snagged. Guys, I got the underspin on now. It just feels so good to not have to throw that craw anymore. Mason's casting while Trey's. <laughs> I've been snagged for 30. Oh! oh my gosh, that was a giant. <gasps> it's big, it's big, Mason. Dude, that was like a, that was like a seven pounder. You can see it, right? Yeah, no, I saw the whole entire fish, bro. It was an absolute giant. I saw it underwater and it just disappeared. Make oh. sure you're make sure you're rigged right again. Yeah. yeah. 
Well, he hit up top and then underwater. So guys, Trey just lost his uh, his patroller for pee. So now he's gonna go back to any of his lures, but he's gonna have to catch two just to make up for it because it was his last bait. <laughs> It's an after, I kinda wanna sling that horny dead around a little bit. Oh, I got one, I got one, I got one! <laughs> oh, oh no, what a water spin, dude. It's got such a tiny hook and I'm in the pads. Yes, one lure left and it's the buzz bait. Uh-oh, oh! Well guys, little, uh, little underspin, little bass, see you buddy? That leaves me with one, boys. How, How much do you have, you have two, Mason? Two, but I'm about to have one left. This is just too perfect for me. <sighs> Listen, you got me facing towards this. Casting on top of me, dude. You know how you don't face towards that? <laughs> it's the boat path. Face towards the lake. Right, G. Dude, I can't get bit on this lizard to save my life. Oh, facing big <laughs> Is it still on there? Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Real, nice real. I'm real. trying. Keep reeling, keep reeling. Front tip up, keep reeling. I'm trying. Real hard. I'm hard, hardly. Are you reeling hard or are you hardly reeling? Is he on there? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> the horny zone. Yes. Nice. All right. Oh, just barely hooked. Thank you, thank you. Send you back home. I got one lure left. Uh oh, and it's kind of an easier one, too. <laughs> yeah. See you later, Stinky. Norm, please catch one so I don't lose to Mason, dude. I can't lose to Mason. Oh, I'm certain you can because you're about to. He's just backboating the fire out of me right now, dude. He's getting backboated harder than a kid in right field picking his boogers. No, from this is the cast that wins it. No, sir, no, sir. I'll you want to actually get us out there so I get blown up on by a buzz beat for real? Yeah, I got you. Mason. Dude, I want to win this challenge. So I have 87% left of my battery and you guys are about to die. <laughs> All right. But also I am kind of jealous. That little spinner does look kind of fun. Yeah, <laughs> it is. Also, this Abu Garcia reel is just falling apart. Really? Yeah, you could feel like, oh. Oh! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> that is mad disrespectful. Please tell me that wins the challenge. Okay. <laughs> I beat it technically. I just want everybody to know I beat Trey and Norm. That's the lamest way of winning. That's almost Dude, like I think it has to be a keeper, a 15 inch keeper. With a hand sized bass. Look how small that thing is. <laughs> no way. Thank Dude, you, buddy. Thank you, buddy. I win the day. Woo. No. Losers. Losers, losers. L for losers. Your back is out of here, bro. <laughs> Please, Four for dude. All right, so <laughs> Mason ended up winning. I snapped my buzz bait off, and Trey had a lot of trouble with the kiddie pole. But it was a super close game, guys. Make sure you subscribe if you enjoy the videos like this. And a video just like this one is popping up right now, so go ahead and watch it. But thank you guys so much for watching. Until the next fishing adventure, fish bump, I'm out of here. <laughs>